All right, guys, how's it going? So earlier today, I made a video, and to be honest, it was a little bit long-winded, and I wasn't entirely happy with it myself. And I got a few comments, this video's too long. So here's a short version. In order to create the mirror effect, we need to use a layer weight node, and that essentially drives the fall off. So we take the facing value and we put that into a color ramp node. Now the color ramp node, we can actually squeeze the values of the colors using a simple setup like this. We then take the color and put that into a hue and saturation node, and then we take the color from the hue and put that into the base color. And that's pretty much the basics of the node. Now obviously to get that metallic, you put the metallic value right up. If you're wanting to control the roughness, so you're wanting this 100% mirror, drop the roughness right down and you get this perfect mirror. Obviously the higher the value, the more roughness you're adding into the scene. Now one of the extra steps that I took was to add in a noise texture. I then take the colour value and I put it into the detail. I then take the factor and put that back into the hue and we get this kind of nice effect. So the second step I take is add in a displacement node. I take the colour, I put that into the height, I put the displacement into the displacement and we get this really nice displacement effect. And that's pretty much the basics of the tutorial. Hopefully I've saved you four or five minutes. Do me a favour guys, like the video, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, you know what to do.